Hi guys, hope you're all well. <clears throat> yes, I've still got a croaky throat. I don't know what's going on, guys. I just can't seem to shift it. But anyway, you'll just have to bear with me and my croak. Um, today, I've got something really exciting to show you. Um, my lovely friend, Shelley, um, who runs, uh, I'll pop this in short, she runs PC UK Tools, so UK based. Um, polymer clay tool shop um, and I ordered um, one of her bead kits because you know I've been really into beads lately and she gave me a message and said could I send you just a few bits for you to have a little play with and of course who's going to say no to that so she did send me a few bits oh my god a few I don't know what obviously my interpretation of a few bits is totally different than Shelley's but I'm not going to complain guys honestly she's outdone herself bless her so I'm going to go through all the stuff she's sent me and in upcoming videos um, as I do with Sarah and as I do with Yaroslav uh, I'll be featuring um, some products in um, in upcoming videos um, and of course guys if you haven't got the products there's other ways around things if you can't go and get them yourselves i know i'm extremely lucky because these lovely people send me things so first off i'm going to show you because i've been in bead mode I, this packaging lovely this is what i ordered um so this has been paid for by me um because I wanted to do some, oh can't get the lid off, I wanted to do some um, different sorts of beads for you guys, um, so I've ordered this beading kit, so you get a little leaflet that comes with it, and then you get all manner of goodies, oh I've just got to get them out of the box guys, sorry they're packaged really well, um, so this is an acrylic plate. It's coated with some plastic at the minute guys. That's why it looks so frosted But it's a three mil acrylic plate for Swirling and pressing and the such so that comes with your bead kit Then you get some beading needles. Let me get these out You get <coughs> Excuse me three double-ended beading needles like so I'll not take them out of the pack yet guys you can see through the camera can't you double ended not overly sharp but nice uh, you know you don't want them don't, don't want to be stabbing yourself so you get that size of beading needle and then you get three larger sides of the more of the skewer type so one end is blunt one end is sharp so you get those sets of beading needles in the kit you also get these fabulous tubes which ergonomically appeal to me anyway but you can see they've got markings on them so you can measure out um, the size of your beads on them and obviously you can use them for poking holes and the such but these are stainless steel I believe let's have a look steel tubes yes yeah. so these are steel tubes you get three steel tubes for wrapping and the such um, you know to form your beads etc and you also get this lovely brush that will clean your tube out if you get any gunk stuck in it and I think that would make quite a nice pattern on your clay as well so there we go three of them sorry about the clattering then these are the bits i'm excited about i haven't unwrapped anything guys because i wanted to unwrap it with you you know i get a bit giddy when i'm doing these haul videos it's like christmas so inside this lovely vellum is three different templates and again guys these have got a protective coating on as you can see um, so they don't get marked or scratched while they're being delivered and these are to make the lovely rolled up tube beads which is why I wanted to get this template um, 
<coughs> so you get those three different sizes of those in and then in here when shell is written on please be careful sharp blade attention she obviously knows how clumsy i can be so let's get this open i don't want to rip this lovely paper it is like christmas isn't it so yes so also in the kit you get open open come on a really lovely wow that's substantial guys it's a really chunky sharp and it looks extremely sharp blade um, it is a lot thicker than uh, your usual blade I'll just bring one in to show you that's my usual flexible tissue blade and that's the blade that comes with the kit you can see the difference uh, in the thickness that is one substantial blade I'm going to pop that back in the paper then I don't cut my fingers and that's what you get in the bead kit guys so a lovely blade six skewers different lengths your three tubes your cleaner your templates and your uh, acrylic rolling mat um, and I'm not 100% sure I think Fiona Abel Smith has used this kit in a video I will check um, but yeah it just talks you through how to make a few different beads guys uh, but a lovely kit and that is £20 um, <coughs> Shelley does deliver to anywhere in the world but as some of you may know she does have a um kind of a collaboration with the lovely teresa over at tiny pandora so some of her kits um are not available for sale to the usa because teresa sells a similar kit um and that bead kit is one of them so if you're in the us go and go over to um tiny pandora site i'll pop a link in um so that you can go and have a look on uh, Teresa's site uh, for similar site types of tools okay next now everything okay guys here's some of the uh, acrylic stencils again I've not opened up the packet because it's like Christmas so I don't actually know what's in here Ooh, look at these beauties so these are perspex acrylic you can see the thickness of them and they're all templates these make a lovely veil wouldn't they um, so you get the inny and the outer so you can cut through or use that bit as your template um, I'll just peel back a bit of this surface just so you can see clarity of the acrylic lovely quality I think they're about three mil thick so there's this one there's a kind of pendant forming one you can see there and of course again you get the inny and the outy these are the A five size guys then there's the a4 which you can see here i know you can't make it out very well guys sorry uh, if i just angle it there we go uh, and i'll pop a couple of these out and show you so you've got these lovely shapes uh, again and you've got the inner and the outer of the shape uh, so these are all nice like curved shapes fabulous uh, and then I've got the teardrop one in the A4 as well and these are some of these are substantial I'll take the biggest out so that you can see again guys don't forget they've got a film on um, and the beauty that edging is so they've been beautifully cut really smooth no sharpness be really easy to just put this over your work and run a blade round 
and for doing um, maybe some of the um, what's it called Dan McCormick method where you push through again perfect um, templates for doing that sort of thing with but the smallest one is this one here and it is super tiny like a tiny tiny little teardrop can you see there look at that so you get a super tiny one all the way through to this huge one and um, I'll just they are let me see um, 10 pounds for the a5 i think just let me bring them up guys it's the only thing i'd put them to one side um yeah the a5 ones and there's loads of different shapes on the website uh uh, dip, uh from 10 pound or this one's seven pound 50 at the minute um and let me just find the a4s and the a4s are 15 pound that's this size and again lots of different um, patterns available on the website and you can also create your own for 18 pounds there's a little button that you can click uh, and download uh, I'm assuming Shelley gets in touch with you and you can download um, your own template and have it cut for yourself which is a fabulous idea uh, but yeah I love this shape it's just like really unusual isn't it uh, so yeah I've got lots to play with haven't I um, aren't they fab I can't wait to get this plastic off apparently Fiona Abel Smith says on your big template leave your backing on makes it easier to place I need to go and check that video out a friend gave me the tip the other day and said it had come from Fiona uh, but I will check that out guys and you'll see me I'll do a video featuring these maybe we could do a nice collar piece or something that'd be good wouldn't it something else I'm going to show you is what the few bits that Shelley popped in from it so I've got a bangle kit now I already own two of the uh, cuff kits I've got the large one and the small one they all come with templates and the such uh, but these are the uh, proper bangle kits and these are substantial tubes no seam as you can see beautiful beautifully made these are for the bangles I'll just unwrap all these get the rustling over and done with these are really well machined guys as well there's no sharp matte edges on them you know you can get your hand over it while you test things out so you get three different sized tubes I'll just turn them over so you can see for your bangles and then you get the oh they stack inside each other nicely and then you get the uh, template to go with it uh, again I don't like ripping this lovely vellum so you get one two three four five again guys they're covered in plastic um, just to protect the cover the face of it but you get five different uh, acrylic templates for different sizes um, and you also get this sheet that talks you through um, how to make you know do different things to make the bangle with uh, apart from your, you know you just plain bangle how to make it bigger and smaller and the such uh, and that kit again is 20 pounds and again guys if you're in the US uh, go and have a look on tiny pandora site i believe she has something if not like the same very similar uh, but everywhere else in the world um you can go and shelly will deliver this to you just pop these to one side so that's two of the kits 
and the next thing is just some bits and bobs of tools and stuff so I think first I'll do the stencils with you so I have this lovely stencil kit I'll just show you each one there's a floral run and you know I love these mylar style stencils they're really handy because you can make an impression in the clay as well as put a pattern through so there's a floral one an animal print one a diamondy checkerboardy style one there's a, a dots and bubbles one uh, there's a um, again I think that's like an animal print one there's a very fine chevron one and there's this uh, looks like crocodile skin or something doesn't it or you know um, cobbles or something one now they come in in a kit together uh, and the kit of flexi stencils is 14 pound for seven so you get a little bit of a saving though if you buy the kit but they are all available singly as well if you go and have a look so that's the flexi stencil stencils the mylar ones She's also sent me these beautiful silk screens. Um, quite geometric, the ones she's sent me. I'm just going to, I'm not going to take them out of the bags, guys. Can you see the pattern through? The balls is a bit off putting, isn't it? But you can see there's the, there's one pattern. Here's like a repeating kind of floral pattern another I love this one this geometric print uh, it's like mosaic isn't it there's that one there's loads on her site guys and here's another similar one to that but it's like a larger print and I took one out the bag the reason I've not taken them out the bag is because I've got a bit of cat fluff with the cats and I don't want everything getting gunked up till I've had a hoover uh, but these are fabulous they're not the plasticky style ones um, they're more on the line of the um, oh what they're called you know the M is it M-O-I-K-A Mioka style screens like the proper silk screens not the plasticky coated screens excellent quality uh, really flexible feel quite tough as well now I've not had a chance to use any of Shelley's screens yet um, so I will have a go uh, do a video with using a couple of these and she's also popped me a little uh, credit card style scraper in which is a nice touch and the silk screens are I believe four pounds each which is really good value isn't it for the good quality ones uh, so go and have a pop and have a look at those so that's silk screens and stencils now we've got some bits of tools so the <clears throat> you've all I think a lot of people already have these don't they but in this kit you get two different sizes um, so these are the smaller ones and they go absolutely teeny tiny uh, little plunge cutters guys with no seam on them so you get a nice circle but there is an absolutely teeny teeny tiny one uh, and that's the largest one in this kit um, like I say Shelley sent me the kit with them both in so the price for them both is I'm sure I wrote it down du, 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 du. £10 for the full kit so there is um, umpteen in there and then in this little box is the bigger ones now I've never seen them in this size um, but these are a fab size look at the size of them so some really good sizes there as well and again beautiful seam free little plunge cutters there's one two three four five in there so umpteen in there seven or eight maybe one two three four five six seven eight nine oh there's ten in there five in there so a set of 15 circle cutters for 
do, do, do. What did I just say? Do you know? Oh yeah, she calls them uh, dotting tools. Um, is that's why I'm not finding the name because I just call them circle cutters. Um, so that's ten pound for the full set of them. Then we've got some lovely wavy blades. Now I think we've all, probably all got one of these that we chuck in the back of our drawer because we never use them. Uh, but I've been seeing some interesting things with Makumegane actually, guys, um, where people are using the but uh, using the wavy blades, zigzag blades with Makumegane. That's pretty cool. I may have to have a go at that. But you get three different sizes, so you get a super fine one you see that yeah then the next one up is this one and then i've never seen one this size it's a real decent zigzag it's more of a zigzag than a wavy ripple that one isn't it if that makes sense if i hold them all together you can see the difference uh, some are more of a ripple, some are, that's more of a zigzag. But those three tools, da, 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 £2.30 for three, which again, very good value. Great for with your Makume Gane or putting patterns in your clay and the such, or gouging out when you're doing your um, hidden magic style Makume Gane. So give us a twist on that, won't it? And then, I've been after one of these for ages, and she's sent me one. So, just a little moulding tool. Now, I think they're dental tools, aren't they? We've all, you know, we all use these little kits. But it's quite a firm rubber tip, you know, for smoothing. And I suppose pointing and stuff, dappling. You could even get a nice pattern with the handle, couldn't you? Uh, so these are just um, a rubber tipped tool and these are £6.50 aluminium I think with a rubber tip you can buy the rubber tip extra rubber tips as well if this one starts getting a bit uh, worn uh, so that's those tools and then just some little bits that she's chucked in um, just a little handy porky tool with a, with a nice pink handle quite sharp we all need these don't we I've, I've got a plethora of them everywhere so a nice little needle tool there they're a pound so you can't grumble at that either can you and she also popped in some of these little gems you see them and I know she does sell a, a selection of findings and um, gems and things for putting in your clay guys so go and check that out as well so that's that's it guys really i've gone through everything with you um really really chuffed that um these extra bits that shelly thrown in amazing thank you so much for watching and as i've said i'll uh, be using some of these tools over the next um well i'll be using them a lot won't I? because i wanted some but uh, you know maybe we'll do a bangle one day or something uh, and obviously do some stenciling and silk screening and the such but there you go guys um, I just wanted to share that little haul with you I'll leave some links in the description as always uh, thanks for bearing with me I know I seem to be doing a lot of haul videos lately don't I but I know you guys just like to see stuff um, you know and have me talk about it uh, before you kind of make your minds up uh, but yes pop along to PC UK tools I shall leave a link uh, to tiny Pandora as well for our US viewers who can go and buy some of the beading caning kits and the um, the bangle kits and the such uh, I believe Teresa sells them over on her site uh, like I said, she collabs with Shelley over these sort of tools to make them available really for the UK people. Uh, so there we go. Thanks ever so much for watching and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye.